something about you. Doesn't sit right. Yes? Wouldn't peg you as the rapture type. Not even a little. If you mean I have no interest in joining the Andrew Ryan book club, you'd be right. Just another set of fanatics with a different set of... Ask me how I lost Sally. I gamble. Took her somewhere a kid's got no business being. I was winning. In a place like that, you don't let a kid out of your sight. But you did. Yeah, and here we are. But the million dollar question is, what's she to you? I have an interest in reuniting you with her. Isn't that reason enough? Let's hope Cohen was on the level when he said this is where we'd find Sally. I can only imagine what they would do with a child in a place like this. Cohen's halfway to Splice Town. Probably thought putting a child in prison would be high art. The sooner we find her, the better. Come on out of there! Sally! Papa's got all sorts of plans you. You go! <laughs> Sally, come out of there. I can't see her. What are you doing? This is a schematic for the venting system. It shows there are more vents like this one in electronics, the bistro, returns, the book department, and the appliance show floor. So? If she's in there, there are only six vents she can come out of. And now there are five. All these vents are connected to the central heating unit. If we close them off and turn the heat up, she'll be forced out through the central exhaust. It's the only exit. You want to burn her alive? No, we just make it hot enough to flush her out. You can't do that. Look, either we find her, or one of those splicers will. <sighs> All right. Where are the other vents? Up ahead. <laughs> Open this, Elizabeth? Sure thing. It's done. He just wants to give you a little squeeze. <laughs> Welcome to the Circus of Value! No you don't want to disappoint your old uncle now, do ya? You come out of there! Ain't no fear keeping that tasty Adam locked up in your stomach. Ain't no fear. Quiet, you yeg! She comes out for the honey, not the vinegar. Another vent. Close it. Of another future, huh? Yeah, the kid got hold of that damn radar range last night. Started trying it out on everything. Apples, 
marshmallows, spoons. Had himself a fine time until our peak at ease stepped in the way. And for some reason, I'm the one in touch with the wife. Well, I locked the damn thing up. Oh, uh, so don't forget the code. It's 3958. to now. specials or, or are you already decided? Well, we got a real fine key lime pie. We serve it nice and cold. <laughs> nice and cold. Well, there's the peach cobbler. Right now. figure out if the thing's designed to cook a turkey or a splicer. Damn door's got a key code lock. No way to get in without knowing what it is. There are millions of bacteria in each drop of saliva. Did he, did he brush his teeth? What if, what if he touched a doorknob and then put his fingers to his lips? I waited weeks for that kiss. Then...
number 17 regarding unknown phenomena phenomena presents is odd shimmer to which is observed what men in strange hats women in large dresses buildings that float is phenomena window to other space other time what was it Einstein said the only reason for time is so not everything happen at once. Than that. Look at that thing. You'll know it when you see it. 
you see it. Fancy putting those lock picking skills to work? Let me have a look. Oh, isn't everything just wonderful? Done. The food, the band. Even your parents are behaving. <laughs> really? You mean it? <laughs> I tried so hard to reduce to fit into this gown. I just wanted to look beautiful for you. Over there. I knew you right away, it? silly. Right there at the cashmere. They were sitting with that horrible girl. Her name. And I said to myself, soon he'll be safe. I don't know if she was dangerous or just insane. Next time, I'll be sure to ask. Got it. There's another vent. Now. You bet. Friend of the <laughs> <laughs> you were my friend. <laughs> 